All right, round two. Spelling bee, wordle, connections, letterbox, tiles, vertex, and Sudoku. These are the titles of the games that we are gonna be checking out tonight. They're all on New York Times' website, and I think it'd be fun to look at them, see how I fare at each one, and then rank them based on nothing other than my enjoyment of them. If I suck at them, then that means I probably did not enjoy it. I don't know how to play any of these except Wordle, because I play it almost every night. I do the word of the day. I've played Connections. I don't understand it. Letterbox. I've done this one. This one's pretty fun. Sudoku's a classic. Anyway, starting with Spelling Bee. Let's see how Spelling Bee stacks up. And I went the extra fancy route. I even got a freaking template ready for dragging and dropping stuff. How many words can you make with seven letters? Oh, I'm not on that screen. Okay, so bet. That's the first one I see. Too short. Well, then I'll go belt four letters okay i am bad at this already uh bait is actually not spelt like that yeah this game's an f tier no i'm just kidding hey bay what's up bay oh well you know what i could always do like a all right i'm at the point where i'm about to start screaming because i suck at word games why did i choose to do this i don't know but let's do it anyway tile tile why didn't i even figure tile bite is a word light is a word can i duplicate letters because if i can i can go beat beat Oh, how long do I spend on each game? Oh, 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 I was about to show my teeth. Good call. But this one, Spelling Bee, I, I, it's just not for me. I am going C tier on Spelling. Not for me, but definitely people out there that are going to love it. So now I'm going to go Letterbox. I have one play left today. I think that's all you get in a day anyways. So how this works is you choose a letter to start with, and then you have to make a word out of it. I can go C, A, T for cat. The next word has to start with a T. T-I-N, which is on the same little row, so I can't do that one. But if I go T-I-R-E for tire, then I continue on. So on and so forth and get as many words as possible. Try to solve in far at five words. I don't know what that's about. Uh, let's go train. I just spelt that wrong, didn't I? Yeah. So if I go K A. Eh, or Kern, Kern, Kane, Kern, Karn. Damn. Clean. Clean is spelt with a C. Oh, I can go backwards. Tick. I feel like somebody who's sitting in the old folks home in their wheelchair and I'm just over here talking to myself and I think letterbox is fun I think I need to learn how to play it better but I think it's fun I think the concept is awesome I like the idea of having to bounce from one letter to another and they're all in different positions and then having to start the next word with the ending letter I like everything about that Sudoku. I got a solution for this. The big metal dice of doom. I used to be a DD and d player, so I have a big metal dice. And I got dice trace. I'm gonna roll the dice and we'll make up the rules as we go. It is a one, which means I epically failed. So I'm gonna go hard, boom, easy. And I'll probably end up giving up part way through, but that's okay. Uh, so we got a nine. So we got one, five, three, four, six, so let's put a three here just to hold. And then I'll go a one here just to hold because there's no one this way or this way. So one, two, three, four. And then let's go a five here to hold. We have a four here. We don't want anything there. So a six will not fit here. And this cannot be a nine because there's already a nine in that row. So that means we can go with eight here just as a placeholder. And I'll put a seven here. Super smooth. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is a nine. I am. So mind you, this might not work out. I haven't done a Sudoku puzzle in forever. We'll just throw a two in. Six would work. So let's throw a six in there. Two available. Oh, this goes horizontally as well. It's Sudoku. It's Sudoku. Everybody knows Sudoku. It's a classic game for a reason. So I'm going to put Sudoku B. I like the easy ones. Hard ones are not really my thing. I like light brain teasers. Next, I'm going to do Wordle. I already know where Wordle's being placed, but let's see what Wordle is for today. I am not turning on Wordle hard mode. Always start with piano. I don't remember why. I just remember seeing somebody suggesting start with piano. And it stuck with me. So now I always start with the word piano. Lion... That doesn't give me that. It's not in that sequence. I know. If you just gave me the wordle answer, though. Okay. I was like, please don't be the answer of the day. We're good. Nitro. Let's go nitro. 
Intro is the word. I got it. See, I'm just the best Wordle player ever. Has nothing to do with the fact that Night Gaming told me to use Rhino, which gave me like a huge advantage. Thank you. Wordle is super easy. It's obviously S tier. There's a reason a lot of people play it. There's a reason that I play it every single night before bed. There's a reason that I have a New York Times account and it's basically all for Wordle. I play this game almost every single night before bed. So let's do connections. I know this one's popular, but I'm gonna be honest. I sucked at this one. I tried it and I don't understand this. Let's do nucleus and cell. Nucleus and cell. Can I help you? How about I just send something? Body, cell, nucleus, heart. Dropper, microscope, goggles. Beaker. Oh, it says beaker. I kept reading it as breaker. Lab equipment makes sense. Formula, sheet, sort, sign. Gah. Oh. Cell, nucleus, center, body. Yeah, I didn't think that was right. Next time. Oh. Uh, oh. Center, heart, hub, nucleus. No, I wanted to see those. So which one was I close on? This one. Spreadsheet terms, cell, sheet, sort, formula. Yeah, body language, love language, romance language, sign language. Oh, so I don't understand how this game works. So I am the problem. Connections and C. Screw that game. If I'm bad at it, that means that the game's a bad, bad game, right? No, actually, I think I'd give it like a high B. And I think spelling bee is actually going to move down to C. All right, tiles and vertex. I have not even tried these two. So I know literally nothing about them. Connect the dots to reveal the hidden picture. Let's do... Guys! Oh, no! I did all of that without even showing my screen! I was on the wrong window. I'm going to do it again. Uh, so basically, I just connect everything and we get it connection points you weren't here to tell me i was doing it wrong man you're supposed to be keeping an eye on me mom said that it was your responsibility to keep track of me so yeah this game is pretty cool not gonna lie i dig it and besides the one i just did was the tutorial le level so it's fine it's not like i i did anything wrong i like this one oh my god i like this one a lot it's simple but it all makes sense so it's literally you just have a certain number of connection points that each dot has i think i found my new freaking favorite game on new york times this one is legit it's pretty easy but it is pretty awesome lamp 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 okay yep 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 this one is easily f tier It's S tier, 100%. That is the one for me. I have two plays left. Let's do tiles. Burton combo. I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't know how this game works. No match. Oh, am I just matching? Oh, it's just a, a matching game? And I'm just matching the symbol inside? Oh, I'm matching the symbol as well as at what's on the outside. So the frames, the symbols. So I can go symbol to symbol. I can go frame to frame. So I can go you. I wanted to unclick it. Bear to bear. So now I'm ending on this one. So now I got to find a frame like that. So now I'm ending on this one. So I got to find a thing like that. But it has to be the same colors, I think. There's, there's almost too much, and the colors are so similar that it's really throwing me off. That schematic to that one, or that design to that design, that to that. Then go anywhere. We'll go tower to tower. Go green to green. We'll go the frame to the frame. Go anywhere. We'll go bear to bear. This one's actually pretty easy. I am starting to think there are no bad games on uh, the New York Times. Oh, I do it again. Do it one more time. See if it changes my opinion. The difficulty of like sight reading it and trying to see things very quickly is what's throwing me off. We're gonna go see, but spelling bee needs to stay lower. Okay, there it is. Oh, I hit my mask. There is my list, my official Philo Rogue list for the New York Times games. I'm sticking to it. On that note, we have an official tier list for the New York Times games. 
I hope y'all had fun. I know it was actually pretty fun for me. And 10 out of 10 would rank again. Thank you.